This video contains strong language and scenes of a sexual nature from the outset and throughout. <laughs> So now that Vicky's gone, I kind of feel as though I would take over as queen of the house. One, because I'm probably the most intelligent out of the girls now. <laughs> I know that's shocking, but it's true. And two, I don't know what number two is. We're just going to have to stick with number one. Now that Vicky's not here, I feel like War Holly's trying to take a crown. She's the new bitch. I think out of everyone in this house now, it's probably me that's the most grown up, even though I am probably the most mature uh, and the most laid back. I wouldn't want a fucking crown. I'd rather have a fucking protein shake. A vodka protein, you love it? Cool. <laughs> now that Vicky's gone, I don't actually think there is a queen of the house because I wouldn't like to be it. It's too much responsibility. Holly couldn't be it. She's too immature. And Marnie creates too much drama. <laughs> So I suppose the Queen would have to go to Anna. She'll decide who goes to work. She's a bitch, so... The Queen of the house now, the V's gone, is probably going to be Kyle, because the kid's a massive fairy. He, he can't take any banner, he's like a little princess. And Holly dresses him up in like, loads of little pink tutus and stuff and has loads of weird sex with him and that. So them two together will probably be the new princesses. Who's the new Queen of the house? Uh, no one. No one took on that role, and I don't think no one will. Everyone's just getting on. <laughs> We're just one big happy family. Make sure you hit subscribe down here to get all the best bits from Jory Shaw season 10. I would have an annual day where up and down the UK was a party, no matter where you were, what you were doing. You wouldn't have work, you wouldn't have school, it'd be party day. Learn who every girl in the house fancies and stay away from them. You are not going to get anywhere in this house by making enemies like that.